my dad is actually from Latorca, which is why we're just like driving around, looking around and stopping um, at random places. He wants to show me like his primary school and um, where he grew up and yeah, we're just having a look around. So we've just quickly come to my dad's old school just to have a look around. It's raining so um, we're just gonna like quickly look. And he went to high school in New Zealand but I think he was here like for a bit. So this is Natambwa High School. So there's a mandir here, a mandir is like a Hindu temple, so we're just going to go inside. It's raining a little bit, but we're just going to quickly pop inside. So this is a Hindu temple. So they've built a little temple in here. So these are all the Hindu gods and the names are written at the bottom. I love Kali, she is iconic. I love the houses um, in Fiji, they're so cute. They're like all colourful. I feel like the world is just becoming more grey as a whole. Like when you look at houses and stuff, there's no colour, everything's just grey. Even my house in New Zealand's grey. Every time we see like a roadside market, we just like have to get out and buy something. Um, I want coconuts so that I can drink out of them. Bella, how are you? The weather's not good today, it's been like raining on and off. I've been eating pies from this bakery and their cream buns are so good. Cream buns in Fiji are so nice. Actually, every time I come to Fiji, I need to eat a cream bun, like the cream... Why is she crying? Don't worry, I checked, it's not crying out of pain. It's like having a tantrum kind of crying. Um, but anyways, so, um, every time I come to Fiji, I need to have cream buns. The cream buns here in the bakeries, they're so good. Um, and this place, Hot Bread Kitchen, in the mornings I've been having pies for breakfast from here. And the bread as well, like, so good. So we're just getting some Indian sweets from this place. I'm supposed to be having lunch, but there's like this store here that does Indian sweets. So we just got some jalebi. It's like, it's so good. If you don't know what that is, it's like an Indian sweet. I've been seeing everyone on TikTok trying Indian food and um, eating Indian sweets and stuff. But yeah, if you want to try something that's Indian, then try jalebi and try Bani Puri. It's so good. We're just waiting for our food. I got some chicken and chips. I have the taste buds of like a 12 year old. I always end up eating like a child. So I just got some chicken on chips. Thank you. Barfi. Huh? This is an Indian sweet. It's called barfi. What's in it, mum? I don't know how to explain the taste of it, but there's like powdered milk in it. That's the main ingredient. 
But it's spicy. Is it spicy? And this is this is a half eaten samosa from my mum. A samosa is like an Indian pastry and there's like potato inside it. Oh, it is spicy. It's spicy here. Yeah. No. Uh, I can't eat any spicy food. It's, it's really bad. I woke up today and like all the mosquitoes have bit me. Can you guys see? Hi. Can you guys see? Well, no one else is getting bitten except for me. Huh? Should have said no, she's whale watching. <laughs> There's the cinemas here and they've got like Bollywood movies. We're gonna quickly get foot massages. So just next door to the place that we were eating, there's like a, a foot massage place. So me and my parents will quickly just come to get a foot massage. It's raining today, so there's like not much we can do. Ooh. What did you do today, Nana? Um, yeah. Where? Oh, to get. Uh, those, those ladies me oh yeah. Did you get your massage done today? Mm -hmm. oh, we we got foot massages just before. Yeah. yeah. So me and Nana were sharing an apartment together, but we're crashing my parents' one because they've got all the good snacks. So <laughs> we've literally just come here to steal their snacks and eat. Oh, it stopped raining. So maybe I can go for a swim. <laughs> I couldn't find a um, bowl, so I just put my mango in a cup. There's mango in my teeth. Sorry if you see mango in my teeth, but this is from that um, roadside stall that we stopped at. You guys would have seen today. One thing that I always do is like I always leave my suitcase behind when I go to India, when I go to Fiji, whatever. And my clothing goes to a girl who appreciates it way more than me. Something little like that, you know, it's it's even a lot for the person who ends up getting it. I'm just gonna go on the swing for a bit. Swings and sunset. Oh, I just saw lightning there. <gasps> of course, when I turn on my camera, it doesn't happen. Oh, there was just a bit of a flicker. I'm living my best little life, drinking my coconut, swinging on the swing. I really want to show you guys the lightning because it's so pretty. Sorry, Troy, I'll hit it and like, you can take my turn. Oh, so cool. I'm gonna jump back into the pool and go for a swim because it's it's so freaking pretty swimming and the lightning's like going off. It's it's a vibe. Jump in the pool, you're gonna freeze. Yay! I got it. I got it. I got. It. I forgot to close off this vlog, but I am having a beer and I'm on the swing. And there's lightning going on, and it's sick. <laughs> Thank you.